gotta make sure the sound, you know, it's good. Good for you guys. Hey guys, Gold Keister, making more videos again, and today, guys, we got an unboxing. And this time it's something for your car, and it's very important. So without further ado, let's get to it. Oh man, this, oh, it's a heavy, it's a pretty heavy box, big package. Nothing on there, so let's unbox it. So this right here is from a company called Galoo. I hope I'm pronouncing it right, but basically what they provide is a jump starting battery kit, okay? And I love to test these out. I've been trying out different batteries that have good reviews and a good price. Why? Because I have, I have some cars, you know, that, that I want. I want each and every one of my cars to have one of these bad boys. I wanted to test out different ones. Now, I have used my jump started battery before. One time for my Honda Accord. You guys know the Honda Accords. Not the best with battery. And the other time was uh, definitely for helping helping uh, someone on the street, basically. Well, it was a parking lot, Home Depot parking lot. They had, their battery had died, and then bam, I came to a rescue. Everyone was trying to get jumper cables. And I was like, guys, 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 don't worry, I got you covered. It's called a jump starter battery pack. It makes it easy, simple, and everyone wanted to buy it. And they actually thought that I got it from Home Depot, but honestly, I didn't. The links are in the description below. I get it from Amazon. But anyways, so I got some cars that need these things, and I want to try a different one from different companies, and I wanted to make sure that this is good. So without further ado, let's unbox this bad boy. So this is my model right here. It's a GP200, and you can, you can, you can, uh, you can actually see that right there. GP200. Hey, let's, uh, let's do this. <laughs> No. Okay. Oh my god. On the actual Amazon. Oh man. Okay, nothing else in the actual box, first of all. Before I even get into this, on the Amazon link, on the Amazon link when I actually purchased this, it did not have that. It, it did not say anything about a case. Maybe I didn't read it or something, but I didn't see anything of a case on there. And this is a beautiful case, say the least, guys. I, I love this. This is the best case I've seen on one of these things in terms of portability and ruggedness. I like, I'm liking it so far. Ooh. Let's open this guy up. All right, so it has two different flaps right here. I'm just gonna take out, you see it has two different flaps. I'm gonna take out the first one right here. Um, basically, obviously you have the actual alligator clippers right here. You know, you connect a red terminal to red, black to the black, really nice. Plug and play, don't get anything that's not plug and play. Oh, very handy. Has some cable right here, let me, uh, Take it out of here, I've never. So it has some cable right here, white cable, basically you can connect this guy to the actual jump starting battery pack, or, you know, battery pack basically. And uh, it, con it comes out with three different cables right here. You have a micro USB for Android and stuff like that. You have an iPhone charger, and you have a USB type C connector. Ah, this will be really handy for my Mi Pad or iPad that I actually reviewed a couple of days ago. Really nice, I like this. Comes in like that. Has a cigarette lighter port right here. Really handy, really useful. So you have the actual male and a female cigarette lighter port with some outputs right here, really nice. Comes in handy whenever you need it. And last but not least, let me tear this bad boy open. You have an actual power cable and you can see it right there. Really simple device, They're really simple power cable. So these are all the cables. Let's put that to the side right here. And then next flap right here has the main meet and greet of the actual video. The power bank. Let me put that down. I think I saw some, yep, some literature. So you have some literature right here. Make sure you go read it. Make sure you know everything about it. Hey, let's put this down to the side. It's out of here. Ooh, heavy. Really nice. You can tell this is a very rugged power bank right here. Battery pack, whatever you want to call it. Ultra simple, I can, I love the fact, the simplicity of this, okay? You have the light switch right here. Obviously, turn on the light. It has a nice little light switch right here. You can, you can see the light. You can see it has different modes. You can see my face. Actually, it comes in really handy when you're at night and stuff. Has a light. On the actual back, it has nothing on here, but on the top, you have different ports, uh, including the actual spark for the jumper cables. You can, you know, these, these guys right here, you plug this thing in here. Make sure, uh, I mean, you can't get it wrong, basically. They, they have have designed it in a way you can't actually plug it in wrong but yeah plug it in there bam you're good to go and it's simple after that, you have an output of 12 volts and 10 amps right here so you have it right here now you might be wondering what do I need that for bam you have this bad boy right here plug it in into there and now 
you have 12 volts and 10 amps. Now you can put plug whatever else you want in here. You can plug whatever else you want in here. Say for instance, this is my personal, uh, you know, USB cigarette lighter port. Plug this bad boy in here and bam, you're good to go. Now you have two ports for charging your cell phones, etc., etc. This is this is very this comes in very handy when your car doesn't have juice, guys. Or when you need some type of juice in terms of cigarette lighter. Now obviously you don't have to use this. You can use anything that requires 12 volts and 10 amps and plug it in here as long as it has this type of cable. Next spot, you have two outputs of USB outputs. Now, you might be wondering why they have two. Well, one of them is a one amp output and the other one is a two amp output. So this one will charge faster. This one will charge a little bit slower. So one amp output and this one is a two amp. Now, both of them are obviously USB. They're standard. They're five volt output, okay? So make sure you know they're always going to be five volt. And last but not least, you have the input right here, which is really small, uh, 15 volt, one amp input. And basically guys, you can obviously charge this using your car. And as you can see, I'm just gonna plug it in here. And using your car or cigarette lighter, or whatever, to charge this bad boy. Or, which in my case, I'm gonna be using my actual uh, uh, AC adapter right here. Making sure that this is charged and good to go before I put this in my car. Now this is most likely gonna go on my Highlander or Tacoma, I don't know. But those two cars, I require this in there. But yeah, this is, this is awesome. I'm loving this thing already. Turn it on. Okay, so has a white LED display as you can see it's a white LED display you can kind of see the LED right there if I bring it really close and show it gets dark as a white LED display and right now it says that battery is at 69% now why do you want that one of the big things why I got this one I get better I get the battery charger I get is better and it just gets better and better this one has a LCD display that is very important very nice in terms of telling me how much juice I actually have in my battery and in case case it says 69% you know that tells me that okay I need to go charge my battery right now, 69%. So right now I've connected to my iPhone right here using this thing. It's telling me that USB is connected. It's giving me power to it safely. And yeah, it's charging right now. Very easy, intuitive simple design so without further ado guys i want to show you how you actually use this it's very simple very easy very intuitive i mean really you just turn it on plug the jumper cables to your car red goes to red black goes to black plug this bad boy in and you're, you saved yourself you don't have to have another car next to you you don't have anything this is called a prevention device i've probably said that on my other video this is a prevention device you don't buy this thing after your battery dies when you're stranded on the road or anything you buy this before you have it ready in your car plug it in and bam so without further ado I'm just gonna demonstrate how do you actually use this thing let's go to my car let's see how it is and let's get to it so here's your scenario you're walking to your car you're ready to go to work or whatever you need to do you you know unlock your car and hey you know you can see that the lights are working everything is good but until you actually get in your car Put the key in the car and start it and the engine won't turn on. But luckily when that situation, when your battery doesn't have enough power, you have the Gulu jump starter right here. But somewhere in your car ready to go, let's go actually open it up and see how we use this. Okay, open the trunk. Okay, so we have our trunk open right here. Now I know I'm gonna be basically putting this in my Highlander or Tacoma, uh, but it's the same process for every single car. You have your battery right here. Most likely your battery is dead or dying. And luckily, since you have this device in your car, you just basically open it up, get the alligator clips out. Get the jump starter out. Make sure the actual alligator clips are connected to the respected spot right there, which is on the jump starter. Plug these two bad boys in the red terminal. Plug it on the red terminal and then plug it on the black terminal. In this case, I'm just gonna plug it right here. Uh, make sure you're actually putting it on the metal part, okay? So you're gonna be putting this black terminal on the metal part right there. Uh, as you can see right there and then on the red part right here and it's covered it's protected but you can still see the red part right there so make sure you have it on there and then when you actually turn it on make sure you click this little boost button right here and now it is in jump start ready mode so basically you have it plugged in turn on your car and bam it will work flawlessly uh once you're actually done guys make sure that the car is continuing to run okay you know make sure it continues to run now plugging it in and unplugging it is very important okay you want to actually plug the black in first and then the live 
Then on the, you want to do the opposite, basically unplugging the live and then safely unplugging the black. Basically, it's opposite. You want to make sure that the live is out of place and good to go. So there you have it, guys. And that's how simple it is. You put this back in your car, let your car run for a while. Make sure first thing you do after you jump your battery with anything, you know, if you're jumping your battery with this, or you're jumping your battery with another person, another car next to you, whatever it is, make sure you go check your battery, get your battery tested at AutoZone or what any, any, uh, you know advanced part store basically and normally they do it for free they are happily come out and test your battery for you for free and make sure that your battery is good to go so you know get that service it's free and bam once you're actually done with that once you have your battery tested and everything is good to go you're set get your new battery in there or maybe it wasn't a battery fault at all maybe you left your lights on etc but at least you have this in your car and you're never gonna get stranded guys that is the one thing I love about this thing so so far guys what I'm gonna do next plug this guy in and make sure that 69 69 battery life is at 100 battery life and then put it back in this case and put it in my tacoma or highlander guys but yeah this thing is awesome it's really compact loving the case that it goes in will be ready when i am in trouble that is one thing i love about this. this is a prevention tool this is a prevention device basically and i think every car should have it so i'm loving it and i know you will love it Alrighty guys, that's pretty much it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. This thing is awesome guys. I am loving it. Like I said, I have these things for every single car of mine because of the fact I just, it's a prevention device. These are certain things I have in my car. I, I gotta make sure that I have something to jack up my car. I gotta, I gotta have wrenches to make sure I can switch on a flat. I gotta have a spare tire and bam, I have one of these things in my car also at all times, every time. So yeah, this thing is awesome guys. I highly recommend it. And uh, this one is really simple, makes it really simple. LCD display is really nice also really nice touch and I'm loving it and I know you will love it links are in the description below like always so you do not have to worry about that there should be a subscribe button popping up right here make sure you click on it for more videos in the future there should also be a video button popping up here make sure you click on it for more awesome reviews but other than that guys keep your share saying thanks for watching and